Pooh's Pumpkin by Isabel Gaines. One sunny spring day, Pooh and Christopher Robin saw Rabbit planting seeds in his garden. Rabbit asked Pooh, what are you planting? Pumpkin seeds, said Rabbit. I'd like to grow a pumpkin too, said Pooh. A growing pumpkin needs special care, said Rabbit. I will take good care of it, promised Pooh. So Rabbit handed Pooh a seed. Pooh and Christopher Robin found a sunny spot near Pooh's house to plant the pumpkin seed. I will sit here and watch it grow, said Pooh. But Pooh, Christopher Robin said, the pumpkin will not be ripe until next fall. That's a lot of sitting. My pumpkin needs special care, said Pooh, and that's just what I will give it. But first, I have to get something to eat. So Pooh went into his house and gathered all of his honey pots. And then he went back outside and he sat with his honey. He watched the spot where the seed was planted. He watched and ate and ate and watched and spring turned into summer. In the middle of summer, Piglet stopped by. What a very pretty vine you're growing, Pooh, he said. Oh, but Piglet, said Pooh sadly, I wanted a pumpkin, not a vine. Pooh went on caring for the vine. And at the end of the summer, a flower was on the vine. Pooh was looking at the flower when Al stopped by. Pooh, your flower looks just right. Keep up the good work, said Owl. Oh, but Owl, said Pooh sadly, I wanted a pumpkin, not a flower. Pooh, I will be happy to tell you what you are growing. You have a vine and you have a flower. A flower grows on a vine before there is a cucumber. You are growing a cucumber, Owl stated. Oh my, Pooh said. I wonder if cucumbers taste good with honey. Think, think, said Pooh to himself. Rabbit gave me a pumpkin seed, so it should grow into a pumpkin. I will keep caring for this plant and see what grows. Pooh went back to work, watching the plant and eating his honey. From time to time, the ground seemed dry, so he watered the plant. One day, the air was cooler and the leaves were just beginning to change colors. Pooh had fallen asleep and he woke up with a start. Eeyore was standing over him. There's a green ball on your vine, said Eeyore. Oh, Eeyore, said Pooh sadly, I wanted a pumpkin, not a cucumber, and not a green ball. Oh well, moaned Eeyore, I suppose we can find something to do with it, whatever it is. Days and weeks passed and the green ball grew bigger and bigger, and Pooh's tummy was growing bigger and bigger and bigger too. And one morning, Pooh saw that a small part of the ball had turned orange. And as the days went on, it became more and more orange. And then the air got cooler and the leaves fell from the trees. And on Pooh's vine was a huge orange pumpkin. Everyone gathered around Pooh and his pumpkin. And they looked from Pooh to the pumpkin and from the pumpkin back to Pooh. That pumpkin looks just like your tummy, Pooh, laughed Tigger. Silly old bear, said Christopher Robin. You gave the pumpkin so much care that you grew right along with it. Let's all carve the pumpkin into a jack-o'-lantern, said Christopher Robin. So Owl carved the eyes, Rabbit carved the nose, Piglet carved the mouth. Pooh's pumpkin was the best jack-o'-lantern in the hundred-acre wood. The end.